In this video, I'm going to talk about DVR, the digital video recorders that are very important for CCTV. So, just keep watching. So here I have the DVR box. Let me just open up. Here inside I can see that I, it brings a CD, also brings a remote control, and of course a power supply to power the device up, and a mouse so I can control the menu. Let me just remove from the box, it brings some protection here. It comes inside in a plastic bag. Let me just remove from this plastic bag and uh, we can see here this is more equipment with input for four cameras. The front part, you can also see some details. I can see here that it's a DVR with no brand. Really a small device. Here again, the front part, we can see that there is no brand. It's just written DVR. There are some LEDs here and a connection for a mouse. It's a small equipment, a little bigger than an iPad. Here in the back part, you can see here the button to power it up. Here the connection for power supply, control for mobile cameras, connection for network, input and output for audio, connection for monitor, VGA connection, and also HDMI connection. Connection for mouse or USB, video output, and one, two, three, four video inputs. Here I can just open the equipment to install my hard drive. So I just need to remove all those screws I have here and all those parts. Here I just gonna install the hard drive. And also need to install those screws to keep the hard drive in place. And also connect the cables. Connecting here the data cable and later I can also connect the power cable. Then I just need to close it again. So I'm just closing here and need to put the screws back. Just simple like this. And it's done. Okay, now that you saw the DVR, the input, outputs, connections, and hard drive installation, it's time to understand a little bit of theory. So, let's do it! Okay, so let's talk about digital video recorder, the DVR. I have a presentation here about the DVR. Let's understand that DVR is a device that converts analog signals from your analog camera to digital format. Just like we see here, there is an analog signal and then the DVR is going to collect some samples, do the magic, the technical stuff, and convert this to digital. So, when it converts to digital, you can record in your hard drive. And not only that, you can also play back your videos, it can also send your videos through the network. You can access from the internet, you can access from your local computer, it's just digital, so you can do it with the video, whatever you want, because it's digital, okay? So here, how it works, guys, it's a traditional system. I'm talking here about old technology, but it's important to understand even old technology, okay? I know that most of you guys already know new technology, new cameras, high resolution cameras, but it's also important to understand the basics. So here I show you guys first the traditional DVR system and later I will talk about the modern DVR system, okay? It's about the same. I'm just replacing DVRs and cameras. So let's understand what I have here. It's an analog camera, coaxial cable, DVR and analog monitor, okay? Old technology, old school. And then I have a camera 480 TVL, it's an analog resolution, 520 TVL, also analog resolution, 600 or 700 TVL, okay? All analog resolution, you find more still in the market, something like 600 TVL, 700 TVL cameras, okay? And then what you're going to do is connect the cameras 
using a coaxial cable to your DVR. So you connect to your DVR. And then the 700 TV lines, it's analog signal, comes to your DVR. Your DVR is going to use 450 TVL, it's not going to use all TV lines you have here, okay? There is also an explanation, it's too technical, okay? There's technical explanation. This engineering calculation saying that it's going to use, you're going to use 450. And then you convert this to digital. It's 4SIF, 4SIF is digital format. That represents 704 by 480, okay? This is a pixel. So you can record here and can also see in your monitor station remotely because now we are talking about digital, okay? This red text here is all analog but DVR is going to convert to digital, then you can see pixels on your screen. So here in this monitor station, I have a software or I can use a web browser or something, then I can access the DVR remotely and I can see the image here digital. And of course, I'm going to connect a UTP cable to the DVR, the DVR has a port for UTP cable, okay? And then you can see it here digitally, the 700 TVLs that comes here convert to digital and I can see it here already digital, okay? So why I'm using a camera with 700 TV line? That could be your question, right? If I'm using just here 450 to convert to, div to digital, from analog to digital, why I'm going to use 700 TV line camera? Here's your answer, just because you, when you connect to analog monitor directly, you can see the 700 TV lines here, meaning the camera is sending analog signal to the DVR. The DVR is converting to digital. You can record, you can see digital here in your computer, but you can also connect the analog cable directly to your analog monitor and see uh, the camera is still in analog format, meaning you can see, still see the 700 TV lines. Of course, your monitor needs also to have 700 TV lines, okay? So you're going to have four SIF here for recording, and you're going to have for SIF here for monitoring your computer. That's the idea, okay? So in a modern DVR system, it's almost the same. You have the camera here, you have coaxial cable, DVR, and also digital monitor. And now you have different cameras. Now you have HD TVI, you have HD CVI, and have AHD camera. All, all those cameras, they are still analog right? They're not IP camera, they're not digital camera, they're still analog cameras, but the difference now is the camera has high resolution, okay? So the camera you connect here is still using a coaxial cable, goes to your DVR, converts again from analog to digital, and now you have 1920 by 1080 resolution pixels, okay? That's much, much higher than we saw previously, okay? So again, you're going to record here, and again, you're going to monitor here in your monitor station, but now 920 by 1080, okay? Using UTP cable, the same stuff, and here you connect HDMI cable, and you can see full HD resolution here in your monitor. Remember, you use here HDMI cable, okay? So you have your full HD recording here, 90. 20 by 1080 is also called Full HD. That's why I'm saying Full HD here. It's a commercial name for that resolution. It's much easier to say Full HD resolution than say 1920 by 1080, okay? Here we go, we have full resolution here and full resolution here now recording and monitoring on my station, okay? So guys, that's very simple, very easy to understand. You just have camera with high resolution, there is still analog cameras and you still can convert them to digital, you can record and you can see in your computer. So it's time to recap what we saw about DVRs. They are digital video recorders that convert from analog to digital. So you can record internally in your hard drive and you can also see through the network. They can record traditional analog cameras with TV lines or high resolution analog cameras such as HD CVI, HD TVI and AHD. If you wanna learn more, just visit my blog. There you can download the Ultimate Guide and you can understand much, much more about CCTV, all right? And also don't forget to hit the link below and subscribe to the channel, leave your comments and your thumbs up. See you in the next video.